Hello, welcome to Six Minute Grammar with me, Phil, and me, Catherine. Hello. In this program, we are talking about things we used to do. In all the words, things we did regularly in the past. Yes, we look at the phrase used to in the positive and negative sentence and in question. We'll we bring you some spelling and pronunciation tip, and we finish of course with a quiz. So let's get start with some examples sentence from Rob. Hello, Rob. Hello. Listen carefully and answer questions. What activities did they people do regularly in the past? Peaches used to eat junk food, but now she eats. Salad and vegetables. I used to play computer game, but now I read a lot. So Petra used to drink junk food, and Rob used to play computer game. The words used to do in front of an infinitive verb like used to eat or used to play tell us that someone does an activity regularly. Or several days time in the past now. Pronunciation with we say used to with a short ch. Sound used to not a long ch. Like in can I use to your phone please? It's not used. It's use. Here they are are uh, together. I used to use a desktop computer. But now I have, I have got a table. Thank Rob, and we can see from that example that we often use used to with a verb when the present situations is different to the past. So in the past, Rob had a desktop, but now he's got a table. Now used to with an infinitive means the activities happen regularly or. Repellent in the past. It can also disgrace in past days or situations. For example, I used to live in Japan, but now I live in London. But to say you did something just one in the past, use the past simple. Yes. So the sentence I used to go to the gym on Saturdays means. I went to the gym on many Saturdays in the past, but the sentence "I went to the gym last Saturdays" means one event in the past. It's possible to talk about happen now. Use a present tense. I used to go running every day, but now I go running once a week. And we're talking about used to. Let's talk. A uh, look at negative verb. My sister didn't used to talk about each other much, but now they speak every day. Ours didn't used to have short hair, but she had a haircut last week. Thank Rob. And the first didn't used to have a talk about past stage and activities that didn't help in the past, but. They do now, and for all persons, is subject plus didn't plus used to plus infinitive. My sister didn't use to talk. Eros didn't use to have short hair. And they are spelling not. Here isn't near new. Yes, there is. In positive sentence used is spell u s e d, but in negative. Sentence and question: Did you just use U S E with the D at the end? But when we're speaking, we sound a mouth. Actually, it's the same. Listen to this: I didn't used to get up early at the weekend. I used to stay in the bed all morning. Thank Ross. Now let's take a look at question. New. Which school did you used to go? I used to go to the local school. 
Okay, so for the question, like which school did you use to use? So for the question, did subject use to an infinitive? And remember, you is spelled U-S-E, no D. Okay, it's time now for a quiz. Question one, how do you spell you in sentence? I didn't use you to have a tablet. Is U S E with the D because it's the negative. That's right. Number two, what is the missing word? I to the use socialus media every day, but now I only use it one a week. And the answer is U with a D U I U to use. So calls media every day is the correct answer. And number three, is this sentence right or wrong? I used to go to the gym last Friday, and that's wrong because it's a past event that happened only once. You can say I went to the gym last Friday, or you can say I used to go to the gym every Friday. And that's the end of the quiz, and the end of the show. But there's more about you too at bbclearningenglish.com. Try again for more six-minute grammar. Bye.